right guys what is going on we have a latitude 64 mystery box it's been a while since they have put out a box i believe the last time was the royal four box which is also the last box i opened here on youtube so it's kind of exciting to get maybe not even necessarily a new disc but just new you know, some new plastic as well as some new stamps on some new disc so we're going to be checking these out today and then we're also going to be kind of doing a blind guess of what the disc is so i do believe like they stated in their description it's going to have one new signature series disc and the opto ice orbit effect and then the other four out of the five will be a mix of latitude dynamic and west side so i'm pretty excited to a fill these out and b you know kind of see what kind of stamps we get put on these but let's go ahead and get into it i've already got it opened up so we can you know have it face down so i can't just directly see the stamp so we'll go ahead and get started so i already saw the color of this if you can see now it's kind of flat this feels like a saint that's what it feels like i'm gonna go ahead and look it's a claymore B smooth ace now hopefully you can see that pretty nicely but it's got jonathan and johannes on it but how about that that's pretty neat yellow is an interesting choice for that but i'm with it i'm with it all right that's disc one disc two we have a putter no maybe a mid very firm i want to say it's like a maiden it's almost like a maiden or something Something like a mid-range that has a bead on it. A crown. Ooh. I've never felt a crown before, but it's black, purple stamp, west side disc. Um, but I've never, I've never felt one of these. I'll have to look and see what, what the numbers on this is, but pretty neat little stamp. I'm digging it, I'm digging it. Next up, I already looked in the box by accident. We have a driver, super flat, very domey. This feels like a bolt, is what it feels like with the dome that it has on it. Yeah, I'm gonna say it's a bolt. I'm gonna say it's a bolt. No, it's a Ballista Pro. It's a Ballista Pro in this nice blue with this purple latitude stamp on it. Can you pick that up on the mic? It's got a nice big pop top on it. 173 grams. I might actually do a throw of that. <laughs> I already looked in the box again because I can't help it. All right, so it's like we got kind of the. It is a dynamic disc. Disc. I already looked, unfortunately. I can't help but want to look in the box. It's a little bit domey. It's pretty flat. It's definitely a driver. I don't want to say captain, but it feels more like. Yeah, pretty flat, though. Like a sergeant kind of stuff like that let's see what we got let's see what we got nope wrong again it's a trespass just a plain blue trespass with a small little dynamic disc stamp on it so eh, it's kind of nice 173 grams so it's a little bit lighter weight and then the last disc in here is wrapped in plastic so we'll get to that one but I haven't thrown a trespass since I started playing disc golf. It'll be fun to give this one a little a little toss and it's a nice blue color. All right, we got our last one that I'm going to take out of the bag. All right, it's in. I already looked at it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I already looked at it. It's in the it's it's a diamond though. Oh my goodness. Look at that stamp. Look at how pretty that bad boy is. I could tell when I picked it up though, yeah, it's a lightweight, 154 gram diamond. When I picked it up, I knew it was lightweight and it kind of narrowed it down to a jade or a um, diamond because they kind of only come in this type of plastic, which is like their gold plastic. So super flippy disc. I have one of these that stays in my bag all the time. So this might be one that replaces it here soon kind of as my other one gets pretty flippy pretty cool little stamp we kind of have like a thorns and like almost like a poison oak poison ivy type stamp on that bad boy so it's pretty neat but that's pretty much it that's in the box yeah this is an all right box a couple of discs that we can you know go to throw we've got two drivers a mid and a fairway and then we got a new putter a putter that i've actually never never used before so it'll be kind of interesting to see what this looks like but it kind of looks like a warden with a bead is what it looks like now that i look at it it's giving me kind of like almost like a pure 
type of vibe with the, the shape of the outer rim. The bead though is what threw me off. So it definitely feels more like a judge. So there we have it. So we got a couple, um, couple two new discs that we've never thrown before. Or sorry, three new discs we've never thrown before. We have the Ballista Pro, mainly because it's a pretty high speed driver, uh, especially the Pro. You know, it's not really in my wheelhouse of you know ability to really keep that thing straight. We have a Claymore in the Orbit Ice Plastic. It's a very cool, very neat. And then we have a Crown, which I'll be you know excited to kind of try out and put with. So those will be the three new ones we have, as well as the new stamp on there from Jonathan and Johannes. So maybe we get an ace with this on one of the holes when we go play. And then of course, Trespass for a fairway, pretty neutral, maybe a little bit flippy for some people. Excited to have another one. <laughs> and of course the diamond staple in my bag. It'll This will probably make it into my bag at some point. If you enjoyed it, if you got one of these boxes, let me know. This was an okay box. I wish we would get another Royal box. I'm kind of ho holding out for the Royal 5 box to come out. I think the disc A, like plastic aside, I think the disc in it were much better. I believe it came with like the Mall Glory, the Trust, and then one or two other discs. I can't really think of all of them now that I got, but the Mall is one that came in there and it was spectacular. So, but I'm glad to get some new disc I haven't tried before with the Crown, the Ballista Pro, and the Claymore. I've always seen the Claymores. This one is particularly extra domey. So it's got a whole lot of pop in it, but it's super, super sweet. I'm going to definitely have to go do some ace runs with this. Thanks for watching this little unboxing video. If you enjoyed, leave a like. If not, tell me why you didn't like it. You know, oh, whatever, up to you. <laughs> but thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.